welcome to Tamil Guitar Lessons. Uh, very happy to see you once again, guys. Uh, Isaac Thailia. This is part two, which is a tutorial. Part one is a reference video. Suggest you to watch it a couple of times before learning the song, guys. I'll put up the link in the description and also in the cards. And uh, I certainly hope that all of you are very safe and secure. And please do stay at home. Never go out uh, unless it's a uh, very emergency. All right, guys. The key of the song is B minor, actually. But I played in A minor without capo. Uh, if you want to play in the original scale, put a capo on 2nd fret and just play whatever I teach you right now. Alright, there are only 4 chords in this song, uh, which is A minor, it's 5 string chord, and then we got E minor, and then F major, more whole step, you get G, you can play G in this way, or in this way or in this way or in this way I use both I use this G and this G alright we gonna learn this lick first it's very simple guys uh, first fret of the second string play that and then open so first fret of the second string and second string open and then you got to play 2nd fret of the 3rd string and then you got to play open you have, you have to play that twice so from the beginning 2nd fret of the 3rd string open do that again it's so all put together And then we're gonna play second fret of the fourth string, and then you gotta play third string open. So second fret of the fourth string once, and third string open. So all put together. Play that again. Third string open. slowly once again it goes in a tempo leg and then you want to play this what I'm doing is I'm just holding the A minor chord and just I'm taking off my forefinger which is on uh, first fret of the second string and then I'm plucking the 2nd string and 5th string simultaneously and then I'm hammering on 1st fret of the 2nd string. So. As soon as you play this, play three, one, two. Third string, first string, second string. As soon as the amaron goes, play three, one, two. And then you're gonna move E minor. What I'm doing is, I'm just playing root note of the chord and the note below. And, and then I'm playing 2, 3, 1 on my right hand. So, bass note and the note below. So, I'm just plucking 6, 5, 2, 3, 1. And then I'm playing, this is a small uh, filler passage, it's nothing but 2nd uh, fret of the 3rd string, you have to play 2nd fret and then open, so E minor you play, and with the help of your pinky finger, play 2, 0 on 
third string and now you gently move to F major chord now you play same pattern which we played on E minor you're gonna play on F major 6 5 2 3 1 and take off your pinky and play third fret of the second string and then open I mean open the sense uh, if you take off your pinky you will get the first fret of the second string so 3 and 1 3 third fret first fret so so 6 5 2 3 1 then second string from the beginning G major 6 5 2 3 1 2 3 you want to add that so so the, so that the sound is uh, you know more like it's full uh, you you can finish that or else it will be it will be a little bit blank so as soon as you play F same thing you want to play 2 3 at the end and then again you want to play the same thing and then E minor same thing now instead of playing a uh, second fret of the third string you want to play second fret of the fourth string and then you want to play that open so Second fret of the fourth string, then open. Play the fourth, fourth string, then open. So I'll put together. As soon as you finish it, I'm gonna play F major not like this. Instead, I'm playing like this. This one is. Uh, it's kind of simple guys. You play C major. Uh, just take off these two fingers and place it like this. One string down. So my ring finger is on third fret of the fourth string. My middle finger is on uh, second fret of the third string. My forefinger on first fret of the first string. I mean first fret of the second string. And my thumb is covering up and playing like this. Which is first fret of the sixth string. And then I'm playing 1st string open and 6th string. Playing simultaneously. 1st and the 6th string simultaneously. And playing 2-3. And then I'm playing. So then 3, 1, 0. That's it boys. So it goes like. You can also do like this. But if you follow the pattern 2-3 with your right hand, you get this B string open sound which is slightly, uh, I don't know, if you like the sound you can use it. If, if you're going to play that, you can use pinky like this, four finger like this and then open. So. So this F major is like uh, first fret of the sixth string, third fret of the fifth string, and third fret of the fourth string, second fret of the third string, and these two strings open. But if you're gonna play like this, it's like this. So. You can play G in this way or in this way. 
the pattern which i'm following is bass note of the chord the note below i'm playing 2 3 1 2 3 so sorry e minor bass note of the chord note below 2 3 1 2 3 e minor G major. I want to play super slow. If you notice, only the A minor is five string chord. You have to play five, four, two. Remaining E minor, F, and G are six string chord. So you're gonna play six five two three one two three, six five two three one two three, six five two three one two three. So entire song is only these four chords, guys. And when you strum, you can strum like this: down, down. That's it, guys. Uh, if you have any doubts, please drop it in the comment section. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, show your love through likes and comments. Peace.